As we honor the brave men and women who have protected our freedoms, both past and present, it's important we do our part to ensure our veterans are never forgotten. Way 31 Evening Anchor Marie Waxall takes us to Tut Fan Veterans Home, a place where we can help bridge the gap between generations. And they've served us, and so I think we need to serve them. We hope to be a blessing to them and their families, and they are in turn a blessing to us. If you're looking to meet living legends, look no further than Huntsville's Tut Fan Veterans Home. Just to know some of these folks, um, some great people, great people. Director Charlotte Robinson has spent two decades under this roof. Over the years, working with, um, with them, our World War II veterans, um, our Korean War veterans, our Vietnam veterans, and even some Gulf War veterans that we have here now. Um, it's just amazing, um, some of the stories that we get to enjoy hearing. Every one of them has a story to share. For Air Force veteran and president of the Holmes Family Council, Terry Townsend, his mission is personal. You have to coax these stories out of these men and women. They're there, but you have to spend time. So I, I think it also, on the flip side, it helps them feel valued. We're not, you're not tossed away. He witnessed the toll isolation had during COVID on his father, Korean War veteran Charles Townsend, who also served in the Air Force. Hey. Living here has helped him socially. Both Townsend and Robinson agree there's no time like the present to connect with some of our nation's bravest. We're losing so much. Our young people don't understand and don't realize what our country has been through in the past. And it doesn't take much. If you had a group or uh, someone that was willing to come in and just sit down in the room with them just to have a conversation, that would carry a lot of weight, I believe. Because again, that goes back to the, hey, I'm valued, I'm not forgotten. Sometimes a lot of their family members have already passed on and they're they might have one or two family members that can come and visit with them. So they don't have a lot of family that can come and visit. So it's great to have um, folks from our community that come out and visit with him for a variety of things. With coverage you can count on in Huntsville, Marie Waxel, Way 31 News. Way 31 salutes all of our veterans and those who take care of them. If you'd like to see Marie's full interview with the Homes Director and learn how you and your family can volunteer, just open this story right now on WayTV.com.